And next here tonight, we want to see how the fans are feeling after this game. Yeah, feeling a little bit nervous, no doubt. ABC Action News reporter Casey Albright and joining us live from the Rays fan favorite spot, Fergs. Casey, you've been talking with fans there before and after the game. All right, how's the energy right now? It is high drama at the trot. Yeah, guys, it's a very somber but also optimistic feeling out here after fans spent the day glued to the TVs here at Ferg Sports Bar. And despite the Rays losing, they say they're going to continue cheering on their home team. Now, the team will soon be on, undergoing some major changes with the development of a new home stadium here in St. Pete. And that's why many fans like Denise and Bob Rivlin say it's more important than ever to continue supporting the players. The couple tells me they became Rays fans years ago when their son worked for the team and they drove 18 hours from St. Louis to watch this game. So we came down to be Rays fans. So we come down regularly, but uh, this is great that they're in the playoffs now because it's all the first year he worked for the Rays, they made it to the World Series. A victory. <laughs> Same thing, we want to win. Today and tomorrow. Do it in two and be ready for the next set. And the Rays need to win two games in order to move on to the next round. And even though they lost four to zero, fans say they're still going to come out tonight and celebrate how far the Rays have come so far. In St. Petersburg, Casey Alberton, ABC Action News. Casey, thank you. And a reminder here on your ABC Action News station, we are your home for the Rays Wild Card Series. That's right. You could watch the Rays and the Rangers play again right here on ABC Action News tomorrow. Same start time, and this time it's a must win. If there needs to be a game three, hopefully there will be now. That will be on Thursday. You can watch us right here on ABC Action News right after the game.